guys, this is Rebecca Bass and Rod Bass, and to, today we're reviewing Digimon. We have to thank Bandai for sending us these Tamagotchi Digimon. These are Digimon Digital Monsters. So it's a. Uh, man, it's been like about 20 years since Digimon came out. I feel about 20 years. And this is a cool. You know. It, this is just. Memories, especially for our younger viewers, I'm way older than most of you guys. When Digimon was out, I was already in my 20s. So, but I did have a Tamagotchi. My wife had a Tamagotchi. If you know what Tamagotchis are, they're little keychain items that you have to feed. Yeah, I have one. You have one. So what you got to do it? You have to feed it. You got to raise it. Take yeah. care of it, right? There's so, different bones. And you have to basically take care of it. So Digimon, it was like a little step further. So basically, you can do all that same stuff. And uh, you can train beads. And there's a status button, lights, medical attention, album, two device communication, alert, flush. There's a flush button that has a poop sound. <laughs> and a single device babble. Okay, so basically it says Digimon, the digital monster you train for action. Uh, that, I made that more exciting than it, it was just one line. Uh, <laughs> Alright, the back says raise, train, battle, engage the ex exclusive dock and rock feature and put your Digimon in a binary bout against another Digimon. Look on the back of the packages. We can hook up two Digimon and they can battle. That's pretty cool, right? So it's like you're doing like we do in the cartoon. It's like in real life. And let's see, that's all in different languages. And Rebecca said it there. There's all these options on the screen. And I guess these here are the default different little Digimons you can get. Don't know Digimon as much as I know Pokemon because Rebecca really likes Pokemon. So Digimon is a little bit out of my territory. I get the idea. I've seen the cartoon show years ago. But let's, uh, let's open this up and see what the uh, packaging looks like. Mm. It looks like it says 20th right there, 2000 or something like that. Yeah, it says. There is lots of stuff going on here. Whoa. Look at the table of contents. There's a lot of stuff we're going to have to go over and read. This is not a simple plug and play aspect. Wow. A lot of stuff. And hey, you look at this. It looks so small. Like if You think like there's not much to it. But yeah, there's a lot to it. So Rebecca's is orange or green and mine's green and hot pink. That's what we're going with. And if you look on the back, you take the tab and you... Pull it out, and that will activate it. 20th. 20th anniversary, right? Like I said, I know my history. Alright, so. Digimon 20th. So there's a little screen that we have to do. Let me see. I'm just messing with the toy stuff to see if anything's loose or anything comes apart. And uh, it does have a, you know, that round this battery. This is what I need. Mean. What does it say? How did you do that in the first place? You just start hitting buttons. What am I doing wrong? Okay. What button did you hit first? This. The top button? Okay, I'm going to hit. And then you hit the middle button. And then. Okay. And then in. And then. Digimon. So that went on, right? Then I'm going to hit that. Anything e happen? E-M-B-K. E-M-B-K? All right. How do you... you I haven't named it yet. How do you hit and make names? So... Okay. You can make letters? Okay. I'm going to call mine Gary. You're just giving it letters? Because what's the character from Spongebob? Gary. Because he's my little pet. Gary. At least I didn't spell it gray. Gary. I'm going to name him Gary. Ready? My Digimon's name is Gary because I'm creative like that. And it's set. What else we can do? Is it time? Oh, there's a little egg going. Now, how well that comes up. There's no backlight on this. So, uh. Okay. And, okay, I'm gonna hit the top button. You can see, I don't know how well you can see on top of that screen. There's all these little options that come across the top of the screen. It's really hard to see. It's kind of small. It's even not too easy for me. But I'm going to go to the first option. I hit a button. Nothing happened. I hit another button. I hit another button. I hit another button. 
Okay. Well, we have to wait two minutes. I have to wait two minutes. We have to wait two minutes. I say check out it's Bandai Digimon, it's Digimon. Just take it out online. You'll find it's a cool packaging, a retro packaging. I love the little man. It really screams like Nickelodeon slime, all that awesomeness. It's gonna be cool. She's already taken over both of them for me. For my God's sake, I have lost my my Digimon. Give me back my Gary. Oh, no, you gotta take care of my Gary. <laughs> She's helping me train Gary. So, guys, uh, tell me what you think. Do you guys love Digimon? Did you grow up with Your Digimon? Your Digimon took a jump. <laughs> <laughs> I cleaned it. <laughs> oh, wow. There's a brick wall. Did he, just, did he run into a brick wall? Okay, I guess he's... He's either mad at me or he's happy. So, <laughs> for this... I might play this so much I forgot we're doing a video. <laughs> <laughs> She's already engulfed in it. So that means holiday gift item. Great stocking stuff. It will fit perfectly in a stocking. Boom. Right in, especially if you have a good size stocking. But think about this. You want, you want your kids off the iPad. You want your kids off the Switch. Ain't gonna happen. But you add this. You know you might get to move around a little bit more. And do stuff with the character. I think that's really great. And it's really cute. Like I said, the retro style design packaging fits in with everything. Look, you guys see Ivan film right now. She's engulfed. And yeah, you know, it's not always about 4K quality. It's not always about the craziness. Sometimes it's just about having fun. And this well, you can is shoot fun. different digis. See? See? Already. We're going to be doing this all night. So guys... Mm -hmm. Let me know what you think. Leave a comment below. Are you picking this up? Would you pick this up for your family and your kids? I think you should because this is going to be a lot of fun. There is poop. Can you help me clamp the poop? He's got poop. He took a poop. Oh. Let me help you. You know how you can tell so it's poop? Can... It's got the stinky lines. How much so did you, you feed him? Uh, four times. I mean, five times. Oh my and then God. hit the metal button. Well, my Digimon is healthy. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> How much did you well, feed he's him? Happy. He's happy. You fed him so much. He's pooping a lot. I'm just saying. <laughs> my Digimon is super happy because he took a dump and we cleaned it up. So, <laughs> all right. I really have to thank Bandai. This is so, I've never laughed so hard in a review in so long. And we saw this at Toy Fair earlier this year while we still can go to conventions. And I really do appreciate them sending it to us because this is going to occupy the rest of October, maybe even longer. I'll see how long we can keep this character alive and when we can finally battle. There's a lot to do here. There's so much to unpack. And it looks so simple. But you know what? That's the best, man. So, guys, remember the your toys. Play them the way you want. And thank you again to Bandai. Oh my god. Thank you so much. Bandai so much Digimon fun. Tamagotchi style. All I'm right. having fun. Way more fun than we should. Alright, later guys. Be safe. I'm evil. I'm evil.